All right, today's day two of our tech a day thing. And today's tech topic is Linaria. It's a CSS and JS framework that, hmm, framework library, I don't know. Anyway, one of those that doesn't have a runtime. So that was what makes it really pretty cool. It's got zero runtime impact. So uh, let's have a look in the code. And of course, anything you want to learn, you know, the link wise is down in the description. And if you have any more comments on it or suggestions in general, just put them in the comments. And uh, of course, be, you can DM me at Jahur on Twitter. Okay, so we're gonna start off with the main Linaria site here, pretty cool. And we'll jump on over to uh, this Cracko and Cracko, I'm trying to figure out how to pronounce that, Cracko and Cracko Linaria. And these are basically extensions on Create React app that allow you to go and very quickly bring in other technologies like uh, Linaria. And probably take a look at that too. All right, so let's go and build ourselves a Create React app. All right, and we'll bring up a terminal and then install the Craco and Craco Linaria stuff. Okay, now let's configure that. And that one thing you gotta do is remove React, uh, React scripts and then turn that into Craco. So let's go do that, easy peasy. I love extend selection. All right, looks like we have exactly what we started with, except apparently we have Lenari in there, so let's go and use that. And take out all that stuff. Have a look, yep, blank. Okay, so how do we do this Lenari thing? Okay, so one thing we can do is CSS. So let's go make ourselves a really terrible style. Oh my God, this is gonna be so bad. All right. Yep, totally looks terrible. Okay, and the other thing we can do, uh, yeah, another thing we can do is do style. This is only not the only thing we can do. We can do a lot of stuff with this, but I'm just gonna show you like these two things, and that'll get you started, and then you can play with it and try it out for yourself. So we'll make a button. Again, absolutely abysmal styling, and look at that. That is just awful. Okay. And if we look at the CSS, we can see that, you know, it's just basically one style tag that's got all the classes. Now, I don't know if there's stuff happening at runtime. I can't tell that from here, but uh, I'm going to trust that it isn't. So, yeah, looks pretty cool. Let's uh, try it out and see if you like it, see if you don't. Let me know.